Let's get to Ezekiel Elliott, and then we'll get to Tony Pollard here. So Ezekiel Elliott is essentially still an RB2, I think, for most people. Last year, George, we went into the season, and there, he was a really divisive player that was talked about in fantasy circles, if you remember. There were some people who thought, wow, he's getting drafted too low. He's going to have a big year. He's going to bounce back. There were other people that, that thought, okay, here comes the decline. So what's interesting to me, George, about this is that we did see the decline. But you're right. The touchdown-dependent player that is Ezekiel Elliott, are we still asking our question, that same question this year? Is there a chance that he looks good in training camp and he is back to what he was, let's say, three years ago? Because honestly, if uh, Ezekiel Elliott declines even more and loses, let's say, 15%, of the touchdowns and of the yards, he's being drafted way too high in fantasy this year. You'll get no argument from me. I mean, the people, the I guess Ezekiel Elliott supporters will point out, well, you know, before he suffered the injury last year, sprained, uh, I want to say his MCL, but I'm not, uh, don't remember specifically, but it was a knee injury. Before the injury, yes, he was good. But it was four games into the season. You know, and the last 13 games, you, uh, you ate it. I don't know if he's going to be able to stay healthy this season. He does look good right now. He looks spry, looks fast. But you know, last two years he doesn't even he hasn't even doesn't even have two thousand total yards in the last two years. He had touchdown deodorant last year, ten touchdowns. Without those ten touchdowns, you said you give him seven, boy, it's a thousand yards and seven touchdowns. There's nothing special about that. He does catch forty seven passes, but they're for two hundred and eighty seven yards. That's not special. It's nowhere near close to special. He needs that touchdown deodorant. And I gotta think, the the Cowboys know what numbers I'm throwing out there. They know Powell is the better player. They've got to get him involved. Now there's a lot of talk that oh, he'll get involved in more of the receiving game to make up for the lack of receivers. Okay, good luck with that. He is a good pass catcher out there. I have have a, I don't think I have Elliott and I may have been in a couple of best ball leagues playing too many. You got everybody, but as far as redraft leagues that I've done so far, I think I've done five to six. I don't have Elliott in any of them. I do have Pollard in a, in a share or two, but I don't have Elliott in any. I just think because of what you said, he's not going where I want him to go. He's generally still going. You know late second even mid second top third and i think a lot of that is because cowboys are a popular team a lot of cowboy fans out there that will draft right. him probably a little earlier than they really should 